going over the voltage dependent tank heater controls and the precision circuits touchscreen. To begin, go to the utilities menu, then select the tank heater tab. Tap the button below the icon to enable the tank heater. Once enabled, the touchscreen will check to see if the voltage requirement has been met before activating the tank heater. Once activated, the button will display on instead of enabled. While enabled, the tank heater will continually monitor the coach battery. It will turn on when it senses charging voltage, and it will turn off when it senses discharging. You can disable it manually by tapping the button. If you need the tank heater to be activated while below the minimum requirement, you can use the manual override feature to turn it on. To use manual override while the button is displaying disabled, press and hold the button for 6 seconds. The tank heater will then turn on and display manual override beneath it. While in manual override mode, the touchscreen will not monitor the battery voltage. It is up to the owner to turn off the tank heaters when the batteries are no longer being charged. If any of your tanks are currently empty, you will see a low water level warning. This concludes the voltage-dependent tank heater control on the Precision Circuits touchscreen.